Yo, what's good everybody? Welcome back to another Pirate Legend video. In this video, we're gonna show you guys how to get all of the Headless Monkey books, the journals, in the very first A Pirate's Life Tall Tale. It's pretty easy, and in the process, you unlock pretty much every combination in the entire Tall Tale. So, drop a like, subscribe, uh, like sure to, you know, comment below any way we can make these videos better in the comments below. and. Uh, let's get right into it, man. The first thing we're gonna do is find poor Dougie's chest. It's pretty easy. I'm just gonna go to where this uh, dead skeleton is sleeping. Is he sleeping? Anyways, you'll open the curtains, light all these up, and then it'll show you exactly where to go to dig up the chest. It's the same every time, so you can just fast forward if you would like. You probably already noticed the trail of gold on the ground. You'll follow it over here and actually dig up poor Dougie's body. Make sure you bring the chest with you as you have to give poor Dougie the chest to actually get the medallion, which we'll actually use here in a little bit. Some swabby or other will have taken it back to town, I shouldn't wonder. I'll happily share the spoils if you can find my treasure. But I won't hold out hope. There's precious little of it left in Sailor's Grave, and that's the truth. Now, don't mind me. I'll get back to listing all the mistakes I've ever made. In alphabetical order. Dougie's treasure, sure enough. Oh, what a glorious day. Let's see if my key still fits, and then we'll share what's inside. And now, once you have the medallion, just run this way, jump into this little, like, hole in the wall, and, uh, grab the bottle of Captain Bones' secret recipe. Who knows what is in this thing, man. Bring everything back over here towards the back of the ship. Uh, you'll see two skeletons playing a game of chess. You want to start this. It's a huge dialogue. You'll obviously know what to do with all the pieces. Also, make sure you have the cursed Captain Skull. I felt like... You guys would already know how to get the skull, though. It's a part of the main story quest. Anyways, use all the items, follow the dialogue, and eventually you'll be able to take the key that is actually on the table. Bone 
bones for ye. Old bones he could never stomach his own recipes. Not much good at chess, neither. Now there's an idea. How about we show them how it's done? Stick me on old Bonesy's shoulders and I'll win the game for us. Hang it all. It's been so long I forgot about the house rules. We'll need to find something of special value, a trinket or similar, as a buy-in before we can play. Bells and barnacles! Is that the best ye can do? Well then, me rook goes to Queen's Knight 3. And that, matey, check and which means the contents of the pot be mine. Fine, fancy key, and I'll be bound it leads to treasure. Sore loser. No matter. He never could play worth spit. Let's take this key and find the ship it opened. Yo, I want to go ahead and come over to the locked door. It's up a ladder. There's a bunch of gold around it. Use the key. Go inside. There's a ton of gold that you can actually pick up, which you see me doing right now. Once you grab all the gold, just go towards the back of the ship. And you'll actually want to move the sails in an angle where you can clearly see the lighthouse on the other side. And now you'll take everything over to the lighthouse. Make sure, obviously, you move the sails. You do all that before you come over here because this is actually how you activate the bridge. So just take the flame, light it up exactly like I do right here, and then you're pretty much good to go. You can run over and actually grab the key, open up the ship, and go ahead and find all five of the Headless Monkey Journals, which are located right here. I'll go ahead and play the rest of the video out for you. I hope this video helped you guys out. If it did, make sure to drop a like, subscribe. Let me know what you think about in the comments down below. It's kind of crazy because like we're doing a small guide for the, you know, the monkey journals and we ended up having to do every single thing on this map. So I hope you guys had fun getting every single commendation. If you need more help with the other tall tales, be sure to check it out on the channel. You'll find two of the journals in the captain's quarters. The third journal is actually on top of the deck uh, near the dead skeleton and the steering wheel. The fourth book is found on top of the boat near the middle of where all the wreckage is. And the fifth and final book in this short little easter egg is actually found right here it's really easy to find if you guys enjoyed the video let me know in the comments below if there's any other way i can like make these tutorials better and be sure check out the channel i'm gonna be posting guides for literally everything in the brand new pirate's life see at these update hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one man